Hello, members. Lauren Thompson here, back again with your Corral de Tierra Insider. We've got some very exciting events coming up this January, and we're so excited to kick off the new year with all of you. But before we get into it, be sure to pay attention to the ticker at the bottom of your screen as we welcome all of the members who joined our club in 2021 and celebrate those of you who aced a hole this past year. And there were quite a few of you, so nicely done on the golf course. But it's time to settle the score, shall we? On Wednesday, January 19th, the Generations Cup will match the experience of the 50 and over crowd against the youthful exuberance of the 49 and under team. Teams will be drawn by captains Scott Adams and Scott Ferreira to compete in a better ball competition where points are earned in each match played. The format is simple. The team with the most points will earn the 2022 Generations Cup crown. Following play, we will gather like kings as Chef prepares a great family-style meal where participants will enjoy a community setting sharing stories from the day. At stake, a year's worth of bragging rights and the dinner check. The winning team will be credited back their entry while the losing team's entry will cover the meal. Contact the golf shop today for more information or to reserve your spot on four tees. But also get this, First Friday is making its return this year. We're starting this first one off with our famous fried chicken special, and nothing goes better with fried chicken than some beer, right? So why not have a beer tasting featuring Other Brother Brewery alongside some awesome live entertainment? Make your reservations now because we are expecting this event to fill up quickly. But I've got a question for you. Have you noticed the nostalgic club logo that adorns the entrance to the Oaks Bar and Restaurant? It's a nod to our past in this beautiful new member space. The story of its placement, though, is one worth telling. The logo was proudly displayed over the entry to our original clubhouse. Nels and Jill Wiegand won rights to the sign in a member auction. For years, the sign welcomed friends to the Wiegand house as it was displayed in their driveway under an oak tree. Nels hosted a charitable golf event on the short holes he developed on his property. The event, benefiting the SPCA, became an annual party for Corral members. Given their proximity to the club and the placement of the sign, former club professional Jerry Greenfield named the weekend course Corral South. Nels and Jill returned the sign to Corral in 2019 for our 60th anniversary. With the opening of our new clubhouse space, they graciously gifted it back for our members to enjoy. So thank you, Nels and Jill, for your amazing generosity. And we're featuring a special cocktail at the club, but you can also enjoy it from the comfort of your own home. It's called Old Spice, a take on a spiced old fashioned. This delicious drink made up of whiskey, spiced simple syrup, and orange garnish is full of all the best flavors. Using the simple syrup recipe on your screen, simmer on low for 15 to 20 minutes before straining off the liquid and refrigerating. Then stir the whiskey, syrup, and bitters in a glass with ice, topped with the garnish of your choosing. Sounds delicious, right? And finally, as we flip our calendars to a new year and set some new goals, we caught up with our recreation and fitness coordinator for some easy to follow fitness tips to start your new year off right. Hello, crowd members. This is Monica Sardina, the new recreation and fitness coordinator here at Crowdy Tierra. Today, I'm gonna to give you five tips on how to start 2022 off right. Number one, you wanna eat a healthy, well-balanced diet um, full of fruits and vegetables, healthy fats, grains, and lean proteins. Number two, you want to exercise regularly. Uh, FDA is now recommending that adults and children are getting 60 minutes of exercise at least five days a week. Uh, Corral has great facilities. We have a gym that's now open seven days a week. We have uh, pickleball tennis courts. Uh, we're doing pickleball clinics once every month. Um, also open play hours. We also have lap swim hours um, and then open swim hours as well. Um, number three, make sure you guys are getting plenty of sleep. You want to aim for about six to eight hours every night. Number four, uh, make sure that you guys are making time for yourselves, making time to unwind um, and just do activities and hobbies that you guys enjoy, whether it's reading or listening to music or playing golf. Um, number five, make sure that you guys are connecting with your community. So on January 1st, this Saturday, we're actually hosting a resolution walk and run. Uh, should start about 8.30. Uh, it'll be a great event for everyone to just come out, get out of the house, and enjoy the outdoors and enjoy the golf course if golf isn't something that you regularly do here. Thanks. Thank you so much for that, Monica. That's motivating, right? 
I think it's the perfect way to wrap up this month's edition of your Corral de Tierra Insider. Until next time, I'm Lauren Thompson. Thanks for watching and Happy New Year.